Doop doop. Okay. Game. Sports auto saving icon will be displayed on the bottom right of the corner. Do 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 nine zero. Yeah. I guess we'll just go with normal. Yes. So, yeah, larger size because it 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 is really small for some reason. It seems very very small. Which is kind of confusing, but yeah, whatever. No, I think that if I'm right, I think that's supposed to be a head crab. I'm fairly certain that's supposed to be a head crab. This might be one of the things, though, that, that I do have to deal with a little bit is, is loading. As I know, like looking, look, literally just looking at the pictures and stuff of this game before I decided to buy it, it was like, yeah, this is. Oh, well, I, no, I bought. Yeah, I bought this a while ago, actually. No, no, I didn't. I try and buy games as much as pa possible when they're on, like, sale and stuff like that, because I have no money. <laughs> and I was. I don't remember if. If this was one of them that I just eventually said screw it and bought it, you know? I uh, just screen brightness of the image on the right can be seen, but the image on the left cannot. It's always good to have it a little bit brighter. I always do that. Always have it a little bit brighter for you guys. Um, wait, no. No, 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 no. Enter. I'm confused. Oh, it's a scrolly. All right, can I? Here we go. Yes, that is my boy today. November third. Higher levels of Doom's ability have been observed in those born under constellations such as Cancer, Pisces, Cestus. What the hell is Cestus? Well, Phoenix and Giga. Hi, am. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. along with the stick are two of mankind's oldest tools uh the stick to keep the bad away the rope used to bring the good towards us they were our first friends of our own invention whoever there were people they were the rope and the stick oh, once there was an explosion a bang which gave birth to time and space it's norman reedus once there was an explosion a bang which set a planet spinning in that space once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. I need to move my California fund. I love Norman Reedus. Norman, uh, like, Daryl Dixon is my favorite, um, favorite Walking Dead character. And, like, the Boondock Saints movies are some of my favorite movies of all time. Do you Death Stranded. It's so pretty! <laughs> I love it. Play my trees. Treasure Mads Mickelson. Hope I didn't mispronounce that. 
No, that's that's French. Les c'est toi, toi, de, de, de. Margaret Qualley, Troy Baker. I've heard that name, Troy Baker. Tommy Rogen. Who's that name? Sounds so familiar. Troy Baker. Who's Troy Baker? Guillermo del Toro. Guillermo del Toro's in this game. <laughs> Jesse Cordy. Darren Jacobs. I'm Leo O'Brien. And Lindsay Wagner. Oh, I thought a bird just crapped on him for a second. <laughs> that is an interesting motorcycle. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Was that... That looked less like a... Mo oh, um... There are invisible monsters. Oh, it's a slingshot. It's a very strange design slingshot. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Norman, you just knock over. Whoa. Whoa! And deer can jump far. Knocking over boulders that have been there for hundreds of years. Oh, 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 that is acid. That is acidic. Whoa, 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 does it fly? Oh, no, it doesn't fly. Hi, lady. Oh! If she's not dead, that would be surprising. If she's not dead, how? How is she not dead? No! My bike! My bike! No! Where'd the lady go? Great. Oh, I specifically, oh. Oh, yeah, that's a, th yeah, you, um, I know you, like, um. Whoa! That's so cool. Rock. I want rock. Who's that? What's that? So, that's a. Oh, okay. Grab it. Okay. Wow. Okay. Just getting used to the, the controls. Hey, I did not say put it down. Thank you very much. Carrying cargo on your hands. As you protect it with your body, hand carried cargo will not take damage even if you fall. So, is there, I'm assuming there's gonna be like a certain amount that I can carry. Okay, so I gotta go, I think I gotta go up before I go down.
I don't know what that thing is, but I'm going for that thing. The thing with the star in it. That's that's what it, I think I need to go for. I don't know. Maybe wrong, but I feel like it. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, you are judged even on your walking. Holy crap. Can I climb? Is climbing an option? Like climb, climb. No, climb, climbing does not look an, like an option. No. Game, is it? I might have to turn down some of my. Hmm. I might have to t drop some of the settings. Because this this game is gonna be is probably gonna be very 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 hard on me on my computer. Do graphic settings. Display one. Yeah, just let me know if anything gets laggy or anything like that, and I'll try and... any better. I'm so confused as to what I'm doing right now. I've got to stop myself. That's cool. You have to stop yourself when you're falling. Why is that cool to me? Okay, good. Oh, he, he's gripping onto his, his backpack. Okay. I'm trying to figure out how to get over there. Dude, I can see my past footprints. Ah, there we go. There we go. Uh -huh. Whoa, calm down, dude. <laughs> got the rain over there. Yeah. I'm so excited. Oh yeah, I am getting frame drops. Sam. His name is Sam in this game. We're going to continue to call him Norman, though. <laughs> More than likely, that's what I'm going to end up doing. Oh, there's a deer. Hi, deer. He has handprints on him. Why does he have handprints on him? What's that? What's that? No, no. Don't go running out there. Yeah, I was about to say, we know it's acid. <laughs> we watched it eat away a crow. We, we don't want to do that. Wait, what's happening? They're giving us... Hey, now. Yeah, no, that's not... 
Oh. Have you never seen Norman Reedus before? Of course he's cute. <laughs> I'm not even gay. We're bisexual. I still think he's cute. Hi, lady. That's where you were. Wait, 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 wait. I recognize her. I recognize her, her face. Touch my stuff. Does it only have one foot? <laughs> okay, no, never mind. How it was stepping for a moment made it look like it only had one foot. Like it's just hopping around. Ooh, hi, guy. What is this thing? I don't like whatever it is because it's got five fingers. It's got a thumb. This thing is dangerous. Peoples. Why are there peoples in the sky? Okay. they're gone <laughs> what the hell didn't mean to grab you so hard where do spikes go tears a chiral allergy so you have dooms like me i've got the extinction factor but i think you got me beat what's your level you can see them right no but i can sense them level two then what are you doing here trying to stay dry same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah. I've, I've seen her in something else. <laughs> that right. I swear I have. Sam Porter Bridges. The man who delivers. The new courier. <laughs> she had spikes on her shoulders and now they're gone. What in the flames? You want it? She gonna eat it? A crypto buy it a day keeps the time fall away. Don't eat it. Don't, uh, no thanks. Want to come work for me? Must be tough out here on your own. 
Yeah, I thought the Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. <laughs> Not much left of us now, <laughs> save for a few of his folks. And on top of that, Oh. Not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I know what they were for. Okay. I make deliveries. That's all. This is Bridges Central Dispatch. Freelance contractor Sam Porter Bridges. Receiver is standing by for drop. I got it. I got it. Headed into town. Her umbrella's Watch messed yourself. up. Those things never stay gone for long. So of course there's some weird, as we can tell, monsters have taken over the earth or what might be earth. And um The time for fast forwards, whatever it touches, but it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around, Sam Porter Bridges. Wait, no, now I'm okay. Now I don't know what's happening because she just freaking teleported. I was gonna say that it's like a. Um, a thing of, we, we know there's these monsters here, wherever we technically are, and, um, blood and stamina gauges, blood gauge, one, Sam will die, blue has stamina, gauge to place Sam moves more slowly and maintain his balance is harder. So this is going to be a lot of trying to maintain your balance. That's interesting. Dio Kojima. I... It, he makes great games. That's one of the reasons why I got this game. Um, but that and Norman Reedus. I was like, I saw Norman Reedus was in it, and then but okay, no, so obviously some monstrous things live here on this planet. I don't know if this is Earth. I highly doubt it's Earth. Um, but different people are like, um, I'm going to try and get down here to this river. Um, and, oh, I don't know how I'm going to cross this. Can I swim? Is there swimming? I don't know. But, um... The endurance gauge. Okay. Oh, I'm not... Okay, I'm just walking through. That works. Woo! Up, up. I fell over. Yeah, one of, that's one of the things is you just, the stack on your back just slowly grows and grows and grows. Okay. Um, Central Mount City. So I, do I actually deliver things? Is that what I'm doing? I'm picking up these packages and I'm delivering them? Huh. Cool. But like these, what I was saying, these monsters are here on this planet, and um, you, your character has. They're all like certain levels of. Um, But I'm gonna, I'm, for one, I'm gonna s see if the, 
if the audio settings will do something like um No, it's, it doesn't seem so. I was gonna see if it, it, it does anything like, um... Ooh. <laughs> that changed a lot. That's gonna have to get turned down, honestly. But, there's monsters on this planet that certain people can, like, sense. Because, you know, we saw that it was invisible. Some people can sense their presences before they're there. Others can actually, um like see them and I guess it de depends on your star sign what is this music that looks like a force field that is most definitely a force field yeah that's a force field So we're gonna have to go back down. Ooh. Cause I saw like, yeah, there's a set of stairs over there. This is so cool already. I love, I, if I can get into a game, if I can start a game and be able to say that, because I say that a lot. I, I say that so much. That's like one of my main sayings, I guess. Um, but if I can get into a game and say that, then I know this game is going to be awesome. Ludwig Farsen. What is it with people that do audio stuff being named Ludwig? This is walking? Dude. Consider being an Olympic athlete, dude. Right, so, is this... Ooh. Beginning scan. Cargo verified. Thank you. <sighs> Carrying too much cargo. Is there a way I can take it off my back? Take one off my back? No. I'll just go to that, whatever that is. I'm a mailman. That's exactly why I'm a freaking mailman in this game. <laughs> it's great. Offload cargo. What's this? Make delivery. Deliver requested cargo and cargo dropped by others. Okay, oh! You may select partial delivery to submit required cargo currently in your possession and return with the remainder when convenient. Okay. Making a partial delivery when delivering cargo for an order required requiring a specific number or amount of items, you'll be given the following options. Complete order, hand over any required uh, items currently being uh, carried and consider the order to have been completed. Partial delivery, hand over any required items, items being held uh, currently being carried then go back to acquire more. You may select partial delivery to submit. Re uh, required cargo currently in your possession and return with the uh, remainder when convenient. Once the cargo submitted meets or exceeds requirements, you may designate the order complete at any time. Okay. So, I can... Yeah, I'm literally, I'm a mailman. I, I deliver. That's so cool. <laughs> Why is this cool to me? Delivering cargo. Okay. 
Hi there. What took you so long? It's not like the legend to come in late. Had to wait out the storm. Lost my bike and some cargo. Sounds like you've been through the ringer. You're running behind, but... The cargo is still all right. Good work. See you next time. All right. One or more. There is so much to this. Okay, so... Of course, you know, deliver stuff, don't let it get damaged. Hey, I got an A. Wait, so now do I... Oh, okay. This, yeah, this is really freaking complex. This is incredibly complex. Oh, and I don't get to actually go into the city, do I? That's such a weird car. What is this? How do you get into that car? Or does it shrink? Does it? Yeah, it shrinks down. Okay. Okay, I'm about to say, how do you get into that? That makes no sense. Hi, guy. Who are you? Igor, Bridges Corpse Disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. Not the touchy-feely type. Doctor just said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges corpse disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. Kid, I was about to say, this better not be a me driving mission. <laughs> I hate when games do that. That's, I, I, I... Come and take a look. Incinerator. How long since he flatlined? We don't know the exact DOD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. Oh, he wasn't quarantined. Not sick. This is a suicide. Jesus. We're just lucky we found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. Where are you taking him? Uh, closest incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with BTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. You put all that Kyrillium in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with Dooms. I'm assuming Dooms is not some form of acronym. You got freaking superpowers. <laughs> well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So how about it? Can we count on you? Then Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. Just sends them. That's why we came prepared. And bridge baby, huh? If it's helping you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. Oh. 
pardon? Makes me feel like shit every time. Nor plugging into the other side. Freaks me out too. <laughs> Roll out. Yes, <laughs> he's pregnant. There's so much of this game that I'm not understanding right now. <laughs> How many times is he going to put his name on the screen? <laughs> we get it. Let's see what he wants. Well, the world was different when I was a kid. America was a country. Anybody could go anywhere they damn well pleased. No need for couriers like yourself. <laughs> I knew I was a courier. Airplanes. Hell, you could even visit other countries. So we are on Earth. We are, in fact, on Earth. Hi, guy. Hard to imagine it now. As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. And if you were lucky enough to survive, the time fall came and washed you away. Then those freaks from the beach showed up. Worlds of the living and the dead all mixed together. And that's when folks started holing up in the cities. Couriers like yourself got put up on a pedestal. What's bad about a rainbow? Oh, that's not good. Much further to the incinerator. This guy's about to pop. Shit. We're up to cut to the BTs. I don't. This is. Oh, he had an automatic hood. Why does he oddly look like a futuristic Ezio? The engine stalled. Those assholes got us right where they want us. Get us out of here. Sam, can you see anything? No. Nothing. I hear him. This BB must be busted or something. Turn this down just a little bit. You guys let me know if it's too quiet, but it is incredibly loud for me. Okay, we're being attacked. That guy's about to die. It's always the driver. The driver always dies. Just randomly like, yeah. I mean, I haven't gotten any other spikes, it's said. Oh, no, they were crabs. They're just crabs. Why are there crabs? Crabs? <laughs> the 
<laughs> body just got flung out of the back of the truck. Oh, that guy's... Oh, he's pinned. Ugh. What's this little thing doing? Oh, I get it. I know what it's doing. That's not good. That's not good. Okay. Okay, so Whoa, hi guy. Use is cool. Uh I feel like firing into the sky randomly is not going to do anything, dude. Oh my good god. Wait, now I'm confused. What just happened? Mr. Man. You are scary. <laughs> Look at crabs. I will explain what my what I think my theory here is in a second. It's slowly coming together for me in my brain. Was that Michael Jackson? <laughs> I 
Where'd my clothes go? Oh, he completely naked. Um, please don't give me non-advertiser friendly anything. Cold seawater filled with whatever dead. Ugh. Okay, now I'm even more confused. Um, what? Hi! Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. An explosion that will be our last.
I had an idea, and then this game just took and just absolutely destroyed it. Just blew it out of the freaking water. I thought I had some idea, idea, some some possible sense of what maybe was going on. And then the game just took it, set it on the ground, and beat it to death with a sledgehammer. I'm, yeah, no. I'm so confused now. Why is he handcuffed to the bed? Episode one. Okay. Oh, you're awake. So, how does it feel to be back in the world of the living? Hi, guy. Don't worry. I'm a doctor. Well, a coroner <laughs> originally. <laughs> Guy's telling you you're dead. Call me Dead Man. I'm well acquainted with the dead. Not like you, of course. Contrary to the name, I've never actually died. This is Guillermo del Toro. I would advise against that. I'm no expert, but I can assure you it's for your own protection. See? So I'm a prisoner. These aren't handcuffs. They're cutting edge devices that keep us all connected. They're handcuffs. Us. Oh, us. Yup, bridges. Humanity's best hope for the future. Or avoiding extinction, if you prefer. Right. Where am I? What time is it? Watch me. Monsters. Try There's monsters in the background. Stand. Like this. Relax. That just means your body's got a good connection to the cufflink. Look, look. I don't like any of this. The cuffs will watch over you 24 hours a day. That is to say, we will. We're here to help. No. What the hell? Don't trust Two it. Days. During that time. We took the liberty of collecting fluid samples from you. Oh. You're a repatriate. That makes you very special. What happened to the CD, guys? Central Knot was obliterated in the United <laughs> Look at it. Game over, man. The place is a crater. The only ones to get it continue were you. For obvious reasons, and your broken bridge, baby. Is it all right? Uh, it's been marked for disposal. Didn't work anymore. Why keep it? Uh, we lost everyone. Not just corpse disposal. My team, HQ, all of Redford, every soul in Central North City. So. We're at our base in Capital Knot City now. That's where I was or headed I to, was Central Knot City. Our new headquarters. Sudbury seemed the logical choice. But our implementation team has been decimated. And there's only so much they can do in two days. Things here are a mess. Fortunately, the director and his support team we're out of town at the time, so the chain of command remains intact. Of course, the chain of command stays intact. I hate to do this so soon, but I have a job for you. 
Uh, uh, this stencil is from when you repatriated? Uh, what's the other mark from? A clingy woman in a cave. <laughs> mm, I see. Affenfossomphobia. No wonder you were out there alone, where no one could touch you. I'll try to be more careful, Sam. So, uh, the job is an urgent delivery. I need you to bring the president some morphine. What president? America's gone. You talking about the mayor of Central Knot? No, 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 no. Not the mayor. America lives on, Sam. The president is in the final stages of cancer, in critical condition, but there's still time. Why me? Look, Sam, do as I ask, and I promise it will all make sense. Why don't you do it? Because I'm not really here. I'm, yeah, that's... Oh, lovely. Apologies. This is just a chirogram. And here oh, come the tears. Allergic reaction to the chiral transmission. I'm actually over in the isolation ward in the big triangle building. Ah, here is the morphine. Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Come on, you got morphine there. What's this about? Tell me the truth. The truth, Sam, is that America's last president wants to see you in person. Are you really about to say no? If we ever get to not a cutscene, I will try and explain what I think is happening. See you in the isolation ward. All right, I think we're back in it. There we go. Okay, so. First things for yeah, I'm gonna move that. I'm gonna get rid of that, um, cause all those are gonna go bye bye. Yeah. So first things first, I think our basically what happened was an apocalypse. Some a form of apocalypse happened, where it seems like there was a virus of some sort spread, and um, but it was spread. By what looks like these things that it that it it was an alien virus almost I don't know that's what's going on in my mind right now is some form of alien virus happened and it killed lots of you know our people very few survived um, and so people like him Sam Norman um, Sam was created. I don't think Sam is like Sam's like a IVF baby basically, um, but he has like a fear of actual physical contact of people um, and lots of other things. But different people can actually no, he might be like completely real if he has I don't know. Um, but he has so different people have things called dooms which is apparently where they can see these monsters, these invisible monsters. Some of them can see them. Sam here can only sense them. Um, that's by why we got, like, when we were in the cave, we got the close-up of his arm, and you could see the, the hairs and stuff on his arm, right? And he had uh, the goosebumps and stuff. Um, and now Sam is a courier, uh, kind of... So he's one of the people that risks his life to, um, you know, 
bring things back and forth to different cities, the cities that are left that they have made safe um, from what's happening uh, from these, these monsters. And what entirely happened in that one sequence, I have no clue. That's what threw me into so many questions. Um, so the thing is, it, it felt like, so Sam here already had that natural predisposition. He already had some form of power towards those, you know, to be able to see the monsters. But the one guy had the baby, you know, the baby on his thing because it was one that was bred or something like that to have that. So it was technically connected to him and the little uh, shoulder thing that we used to, that they, they used to scan that was connected to the baby. So it's basically pointing out where the monster thing was. Um, if you didn't catch that and that's what I've picked up so far. Um, and now I've got to go deliver the dying, like morphine to the dying president of America that is still alive somehow, but maybe we're just delivering this to make his passing easier or something. I don't know. Um, but the whole thing is, it's no longer the United States of America. It's, um, it's the United Cities of America. I, I just forgot the name. I'm really bad at this. Um, Bridges. Bridges is the new name for everything in the world. Uh, or everything in America, technically. We don't know what's going on in the rest of the world. But um, I'm going to end this first recording of this because, of course, this is going on my YouTube. <laughs>